John Henry, I have a great idea. Why don't you make a video of me before my easel, and I can uh, I'll I'll write up something about my career and what I'm doing and what I like to do, and a little blurb, something uh, not for professionals, but to talk about impressionist art, because a lot of people think impressionist art is like Monet. That's it. But uh, they don't know anything about, like, the American Mary Cassette and, and all sorts of other people. And about the people today. It's funny she said that because on the boat ride over from England to Normandy, France, where my mother lives and paints, I was going to ask her when I got over the exact same thing. But I forgot. And she reminded me when she asked me that question. So that's what we did. Not at first, but I had to go go away and think about it a little bit and see how we could approach this subject and make it an interesting one. Make it an interesting one. Where should we start? It's a very good question. Mm. Well, my life has been actually a series of different segments the best of which is right now, starting in the latter part of my life, because before that, uh, there were too many interruptions, but here in France, uh, every, every place you turn Ma, your head... Ma, don't forget to eat your lunch. Every, oh, uh, the reason I interrupted my mother here was because she was making the claim that the reason why she hadn't painted for 25 years was because she was always being interrupted. And I just knew this wasn't to be the case growing up as her son in New Jersey. And she just never painted. And all of a sudden, 25 years later, when she moved to France, she started to paint. And I knew the reason that she hadn't painted for all these years was not due to interruptions or the like. It was just down to another reason that I really wanted to get her to dig deeper, to express. What do you like to paint the most? Oh, I love to paint the falaise because it changes color all the time and it's composed of maybe 10 different colors depending upon the rock formation. And no area of that whole stretch of land in all of Normandy is the same. You get different uh, rock formations and different times of day. You can get a beautiful sunset and lovely reflections on the water, or it's in a mist. And the mists are glorious, especially if it's... Uh, close to, uh, you know, moonlight. Do the falazes sell? Are they the, are yes, the... they do, especially if they've got a lot of color, especially if it reflects a lot of the white because they have the reputation of being white cliffs. The people love the white cliffs. And, uh, but uh, in order to have good white cliffs, you've got to have beautiful other colors. 